Hello and welcome back to some more Ashes Cricket 2009 and part uh, two of the second test of the series. Um, today we are uh, continuing uh, our first innings. We've had a very, very good start as you can see. Uh, 191 for Andrew Strauss and 90 so far for Ian Bell. Making us uh, 322 for one after 50 overs so far can i just say a massive thank you for all of the incredible support on part one uh, that we did last week uh, it's now going to be on a saturday uh, every saturday at 5 p.m so hopefully uh, you are looking forward to that and, and we'll get straight back into it if you are enjoying it give it a big thumbs up down below it would be great to hit 50 likes uh, on this video get involved down in the comment section all that good stuff help out the algorithm help out um the, the channel and uh here we go let's uh, get going once again and uh and remember the controls and the timing <laughs> important partnership here for england it, uh, it'd be nice to see us get a double century with andrew strauss that's a decent shot We'll come back for the Batsman two. For two. Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Oh, hey, there point. you go. Four runs. Good shot. Wonderful shot. He really punished the bowler there. That'll be four more. That was a confident shot. This is very much a captain's knock. Can he get to 200? There it is. 200. That's when are coming back for two. I think. Maybe not. No, he's on 199, isn't he? Another wow. two runs. Can he do it? Come on. Come on, Andrew Strauss. No ball. No ball. Let's take a look at Hawkeye. It's through the gap, and there it is. That's its 200. What a terrific are looking for two. innings from Andrew Strauss, the captain. Absolutely brilliant from him. And that's 200. That's a great moment for him. The crowd are standing and applauding. He's played wonderfully out there and really deserves the applause. And he's been dropped a couple of times, but uh, 200 up now for Andrew Strauss. And uh, he'll be absolutely thrilled with that. And so he should be. No runs. So he's going to be bowling. Well, Marcus North back in with his off spin, and he was caused a couple of problems for us towards the end of the last episode. Do you think there's more variety in spin bowling now than there ever has been in the past? The variety in spin bowling these days is interesting. Um, certainly, there's quite a bit of it. We've got Shane Warne on the one hand down in Australia. We've got Mathaya Murli Diran bowling absolutely brilliantly for Sri Lanka. And then there is uh, the next crop of spinners, and there are quite a lot of those too. Guys like Victoria in New Zealand, and uh, of course plenty of others around the world. Not quite as good as the first two that I mentioned. Um, I'm not too sure that there's more variety in spin. I can remember playing against an Indian team that had four spinners, and absolutely no fast bowlers. So certainly in years gone in uh, places like India and Pakistan, there were lots and lots of spinners. But at the moment, we certainly have got some great spinners around and it is very, very good for the game. Well, there it is. Sentry for Ian Bell. Absolutely brilliant from him. The English fans letting their man know just how much they've appreciated his innings. Let's take a look at that from another angle. What a innings Ian Bell has had. He's been absolutely terrific out there. Great again. shot. 
Just ball in the same place, expecting different results with that he field. He that shot really well and it brings him a lot of runs. But uh, it, was, it was interesting listening to that little conversation there. and um, You know, all those names that... Uh, for a second. Just uh, have been gone for so long it's from cricket. It's, well, it's, it's crazy. It just keeps growing. No ball. No ball. Ooh, well, direct hit would have got him there. Three fifty up now, and I think we can afford to. Give it a Edge bit of a bash, uh, a bash. Edge there though, which is unfortunate. Just the one. Edge to slip. Another edge. That's him. Not out. Wow. Oh, well, it was good over from Mitchell Johnson, and uh, Let's have a look at that again. It was just slightly in the air. It was a good catch. Good catch, and Ian Bell is gone. He's out for 106, and now Kevin Peterson takes guard. Any man in can't afford any lapses in concentration here. 1700s and 1550s. That's an unbelievable record, really. And what a start for the best batsman of all time. Coming back for two. It's a pity that didn't quite go to the, the boundary. That was good running by the batsman. Five runs from the over. stuff and of course we are going to attack with KP there's no doubt about that oh, it's a nice little shot is it going to quite reach the boundary that's when they're coming back for a is. second so we're coming back for three good running from Andrew Strauss The ball just runs out into the well, covers. It was in the air. Well, that was going to be the end of Straussy as well. Yeah. Good running. The ball just what runs out into the covers. What a shot that is! Out of the air. That's it's not quite going to go two. for four though. He That's sent him back. There's trouble here. Can they run him out? Two more to add to his score. Oh, it's out! That's wow, out. what a Caught. catch! What a catch from Brad had in there. From another he was angle. a bit ambitious trying to sweep that one. And that's two quick wickets. Great catch. And now Paul Collingwood comes to the crease. It's 363 for three. Beautiful timing. That's what we wanted to do with Andrew Strauss. That's four runs. 
Smashing shot. Really magnificent. I'd pay money just to come and see that again. A fast bowler to start a new over. Nicely found the gap there. The batsmen are coming back for a second. Coming back for three. Good running. Really good running. Decent. No ball. He's having some problems with his run up out there. Very well what played. a shot that is from Paul Collinwood. Beautiful square cut, and that's going to be four runs. That shot will give you an idea of just how fast this outfield is. That was a very confident shot. And there's another one. Very easily runs down that's to four. four. That had four runs written all over it from the moment it left his back. And we are... Very much thrashing the Aussies Great at the moment. There's the another shot. four. That's beaten the fielder to the fence. Oh, super shot again. He's got into a perfect position for that shot. Head over the ball, wait forward. And there you go, over the infield, nice and easily. That's going to be another four, is it? Bats it's the longest boundary, this one. It's not going to quite reach. Three runs, three brilliant runs there. 388 for three. Really quick scoring here. What a beautiful stroke. Smashing shot, really Some, magnificent. Uh, I'd really like to yeah. come and see that again. Batsmen are looking for two. Yeah. This is exactly what we need to do. We've got an excellent position. That's now going. Attack. Beautiful timing. There's another four. That is a textbook shot. Good stuff. in the air but safe just the one there that's well played yep yeah, that's four for KP he wants to get out on the action as well his timing's perfect today 400 absolutely off. effortless he hardly seemed to hit it Hundred and four for three. He's picked up another single. Terrible over. Far too Simulating some overs here. So I'm going up to sixty-five. Oh, that must have been. Deep. Just fine. Two runs because he did in the over then. Two more overs. And 
and the end of the over. So there we go then, 439 for three. Kevin Peterson on 40 runs from 36. Paul Collingwood, 38 from 35. And uh, doing very, very well indeed here. Brett Lee back into the attack. Let's see what he's got up his sleeve. Good shot through the gap. The bats want to come back for a second. That's an even better shot, but it's not going to quite reach the boundary. Two more runs. Great stroke. Oh, play. what a shot that is. And that's surely going to go for four. Yeah. That's great raced shot. Away to the boundary. And there's another four. Oh, no, not quite. It's bats slowed come well up. For two. Come back for. No, we're not. Mix up between say, the batsmen. Possibly come back for three, but. It was too risky. Collingwood moves on to 48 now. Oh. He's hit that. Oh, very what a hard. shot that is. What a shot that is. And that's the 450 up He's and 50 really well for Paul Collingwood. Really now he needs to get his head down again and aim for the next landmark. Let's take another look at that in replay. It's a really beautiful shot. Drive away down to third man. That really is an Four expensive runs. over. Four again, or is it going to just the pull up? Back coming back for a second. I think it is. We're going to come back for three, though. Three more runs. So we'll play up to seventy overs, and then we'll simulate ten to get up to the new ball. Lovely shot. Well, oh, that's going to be four. Great shot. It's not often you would have had Paul Collingwood as the quickest score out of these two. He's playing really, really well. It's a really good shot. Don't know if that's going to reach, is it? Yes, it is. It's another four. four. The moment it left the bat. Beautifully played. Over the infield, and that's another four. It's in the air, but it's in a safe area, and that's four. That's high, but I think again, one, two bounces, four runs. Shot. He really got into position beautifully there. We are just attacking the Aussies now. Quality timing there. Again, that's going to be another four. We're just picking the gaps in the field and whacking the ball Once in. Once it the fielder on this outfield, it races away. That four was a confident shot. Hugely expensive three. over. A cookie to start now a new Brett over. Lee into the attack. Shot from KP. Batsmen are looking for two. Another two added. Nice to get KP to his half century. He was in the air very briefly. I'm just going to get there. The batsmen change their minds.
There we go. There we go. That's what we want to see. Six runs for Kevin the Peterson, and there right is now. his 50. He's played so well during his knock. Let's hope he can carry on. Look at Let's this. Take a look at that from another angle. There's the thumbnail right there. What a, what a shot that is. He just absolutely blasted it into the crowd. Six runs. Oh, he reached for it. This could be out. And it is. Got He's gone. He just That's reached for that point. one. Well caught. He didn't really look like missing that one at all. Oh, what a pity. Let's take another look at that in replay. Look at this. He just sort of reaches for it and dollies it up in the air. And it's a good catch. But uh, good innings from KP. 53. And it's now 486 for four. Even that one. No run there. No ball. One more to Sundries. That could have could well been a um back to the coming back for a second. Could have well been uh LBW. That would have been an old ball. No ball. That's no high ball. in the air. That could have been out. I mean, he dropped it anyway. Gonna rush back. Oh, They're having a shout. I think the he's okay. Is I think he's, he's okay. The third umpire. Let's have a look at that from another angle. There's no way that's out. And high in the air. He dropped it. Came back for the two. Easily They're in. Tough ones for the umpire. We get to see it in slow motion or with Hawk. There's the signal. He's safe. That's high in the air. Oh, well, somebody was under it. Coming back for two. Good running. Good strike rate. 494 for four. So it looks like we are going to bring the 500 up. I'd be very surprised if we didn't at this stage. Oh, and they've dropped it again. Oh, he's dropped it. We are just going for broke now. Trying to score as many runs as we can. Well, there we go, Freddy going for it now. Is that going to reach the boundary? No, not quite. He's cleared the infield with that one. One bounce four. There's another one that's even better struck. Oh, and that one six. That's a that huge six. It's been a rather expensive over so far. Freddy absolutely hammering it. He's lost his run up and it's costing and again, him. Again, that's going to be another four. 500 up. Place that superbly. Very well played. And that's over the, the top as well. This is just great his stuff from Freddy. Today. Through the gap. Gonna come back for at least That's two. Really coming back for a second. He's scoring at a really good rate.
Very good timing. Oh, this is just bizarre. Beautiful placement. Four oh, well, we're hitting the, the ball. Fielder hardly had a chance to move. Well, so 520 for four out, now. Batsmen are looking for two. Well, the ball nearly stopped by the time it got there. No ball. The umpire signalling a no ball. That was a confident shot. Oh, What's that could be out. About this one? Yeah, it is. Flint off and gone for 29. Let's take a look at that from another angle. Yeah, I mean, that's just a... Let's have a look at that in Hawkeye. A plum LBW decision. Matt Pryor comes to the crease. New man in and concrete. to be honest with you, I think we're going to simulate the innings from there. How many did we score? 648 in the end. That is... Um, absolutely fantastic and looking at the Batten uh, scorecard you can see uh, Matt Pryor went on to score 16, Graham Swan 24, James Anderson 33 not out, Steve Harmison 23 uh, as well he was ran out in the end um, but that was a fantastic innings and uh, one that we can be really really proud of, it's going to be tough to beat us the key. but let's if see can keep how we get on and pick up a couple of early wickets, then they might be in with a chance. So James Anderson is going to ball the first ball of the match, of the innings. And there he is, Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Only 135 wickets back then. How bizarre is that, eh? I've totally forgotten how you do this. And they, they've just gone for it from the start. Four runs. He smacked that over the top. Four well, runs. There you go, Phil Hughes. Yeah, I totally forgot how you ball. How important is concentration for a batsman? Concentration is vital to a batsman. As soon as you start to lose it during an innings, then you'll get yourself into trouble and probably get yourself out. And there he goes. We get the first wicket. Jimmy Anderson well, he gets Phil Hughes. He's well. gone for four. He's edged and gone. Let's have a look at that again. Jimmy Anderson a little bit short at bowling into those cracks. Absolute concentration required yeah, from the new man comes in. to the crease. <laughs> He's oh got dear. away with that. That's when changed their mind. Two runs onto the batsman's total. Okay, Flint off is going to come in from the other end. No runs there. Oh, good shot. No, they didn't want any. Which is surprising. But they're under some pressure, the Aussies. Of course, they don't want to be um, pulled out cheaply. Fine fielding. Mm. 
Mm, good shot. They're in oh! disarray. Wow. Oh, what's the umpire going to say about this one? Nearly had them there. I can't believe he's going to the third umpire. He was well in there. That was ridiculous. Let's have another look at this. From another angle. Well, yeah, Aussie are very, very much under pressure. You can see how easily back he was. They're tough ones for the umpire. We get to see it in slow motion or with Hawkeye over and over. But in the middle, they only get one shot at it at full speed. So back to Jimmy. Yeah, I remember the delivery review. It was pretty cool, actually, at the time. It's a lovely shot from Simon Katic. The bats want to come back for a second. And this is a, a tough pitch to work with. That's two from the over then. So. Back in. Great shot. There was somebody out well, there, so that was risky. The perfect way to play that shot. There's a fine example. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, They're running very, very strangely, aren't they? in the air but <laughs> good over 14 for one five off the over there uh, you know me I've got to get Graham Swan in he is a beast in this game Oh, straight away causing issues. Of course, that's Not outside the line. Let's look at that again. But well, I wonder what Hawkeye made of that. Uh, causing issues already. <laughs> oh, no, again, just outside the line, but. Let's take a look at Hawkeye. Yeah, it is hitting the stumps. <laughs> oh! The Batson was Too in quite much. a bit of trouble with that delivery. Oh. Well, he actually hits one. The Batson yeah, are I'll looking for two. two. Chaos. Oh, that's out, well, that's out. Gonna say about this one? Well... Dreadful judgment by the two. Can you believe it? Wickets away. And from another angle. I mean, it was coming. It was definitely coming. The way they were running. That was so bizarre. But yes, Ricky Ponton gone. The big fish. Yeah, that was just terrible. So Michael Clark comes to the crease. Future Australian captain.
I think after this series, maybe he became nothing scored there. Uh, Australian captain. Don't quite remember now. Nice shot. There's four. Four runs. Well, he rocked back beautifully there. His weight was just in the right place, and away it went for four. Let's get Stevie Harmison in as well. That was in the air. Bats when are coming back for two. That's Great four. stroke play. That was superb placement. That was a cracking shot. He really got into position beautifully there. That's a big hit. It's not going to clear the rope, but it's four runs. This is not a good over for Steve Harmison. Just over the infield again. I don't think they got a run there, that was weird. That's hit away nicely. Batsmen are looking for two. Facing Lillian Thompson must have been an eye-opening experience, Tony, but would it have changed much if you had been afforded the protective equipment used today? Well, facing Lillian Thompson uh, certainly was a wonderful experience. Uh, there were occasions when uh, one feared for one's life, I suppose. However, as a youngster, I suppose you take... Uh... Yeah, I, I didn't mean to pick Anderson Just again. Just one off the over. Yeah, I thought maybe there was still the fall of wicket, um, but never mind. That's a good shot. Four runs. Four more. Wonderful shot. He really punished the bowler there. He's hit that well. It's a great shot, four runs. He picked his spot well there. Kadich is, is doing well out there. He's probably playing a bit like Andrew Strauss and we've seen what he scored. There's another four. Brilliant. Good placement. That'll really annoy the fielding captain. The ball just runs out into the covers. Batsmen are coming back for two. Oh no! He sent him back. Oh, what a mix again, up. Gonna... trouble here. Wow. Well, that's a superb oh, what shot. What a shot from Michael Clark. Four runs. Oh, super shot. That was four runs as soon as he hit it. The fielder That's hardly had brilliant. a chance to move. Well, the bowlers are taking a bit of stick out there. Let's see how what KP's got to offer. Very well played. That's four. That's over the infield and racing away for four. No ball. No 
This is good play from Simon Catter. Oh, He's doing to us what we were very much doing to them. Shot, head over the ball, wait forward. Beautiful timing. And you get right into the cracks to put him off. Great footwork. Beautiful it's not shot. happening at the moment. He looks very pleased. He isn't hanging about, that's for sure. Let's take a look at that from another angle. One more to Sundries. No, this isn't good enough really, is it? I mean, they're scoring at a much higher rate than we ever were. Oh, this is ridiculous. Super shot there. That was uh, beautifully put away for four. He seems to have lost his rhythm. Another no ball. Exquisite shot. Well, another four that's runs. Four more. Oh, that's good batting. He might have hit it in the air, but it was pretty safe and got him four runs. Oof. There he's gone. He really he's gone. The the well, really had no answer to there that you go. Ball. Graham Swan another another makes the breakthrough. Michael Clark gone for nine. New bats went in. An absolute concentration oh, required now. How's Simon Catch on 62? It's just ridiculous, isn't it? Immaculate timing. That was superb placement. Got him! A dolly. It was slightly in the air, Michael Hussey gone for four. That's 91 for four now. Had. That's when they're coming back for a second. I can feel like there's one more wicket in this before we open up the tail. Another over gone. And there we go. End of... Oh, it's lunch on day two. Jimmy Anderson. And the end of the over. Going in. Straight back in with Swan. And he's gone as well. That's Katic. Katic gone. Oh no, it's Marcus North. Well, what a shame. Let's have a look at the I thought we replay. got Katic so there. It's a left right combination. But now, now, Graham Swan. Three wickets. This is unbelievable. And that's out as well. That's out as well. Oh. It certainly looked quite adjacent. Wow, that was close. Let's have a look at this. This was very, very close. This is an unbelievable spell of bowling from Graham Swan. Well, I wonder what Hawkeye made of yeah, that. I just think it was ever so slightly outside the line. It might have been umpire's call. Had there been reviews, that's well it's outside the line. Appeal. But it's putting Let's them under pressure. From another angle. Yeah. Let's have a look at that in Hawkeye. This is just 
unbelievable. It really is. Oh, he nearly dragged that onto the stumps. Yeah, well hit from Brad Handin. Brad Haddin. Batsmen are looking for two. And there's shot. another four. Hundreds up for Australia, but they won't be happy. Well, if you want to show it's 102 the for five. Way to play that shot, there's a fine example. Anderson from the other end as well. Oh, he's gone for that. There's somebody out there, though. And he's got it. Well caught. He didn't Six really down now. Like he absolutely went Let's for that. The action replay. Fourth wicket for Graham Swan. A great catch from Alistair Cook once again. So the tail now, and these lower order batsmen have got to show some resistance. Shane Watson played as an opener for quite a while for Australia, so you know he can bat. There's no doubt about that. But uh, Simon Catch will be feeling very, very worried down the other end. Here he is now. And Graham Swan will definitely be feeling like he can do something. Really good strike rate from this player. <sighs> wow. He's bowled a really tight over there. So Anderson doing really well from the other end, but uh, we're going to concentrate on Swan at the moment. Because Swan is good. Oof. I mean, look how much Nothing turn he's there. getting. Need to get a Dusra in there. Well, I'll tell you what, I won't complain of Katic going off strike. Let's see what we can do to Brad Haddon. It's a lovely shot. Just Hooking a single the ball low. can be a very risky business, Tony. How important is it to be able to play the shot well? Playing the hook shot is an interesting one. It uh, could be described as risky, but uh, it can also be described as one of the most pleasing shots of all if executed well. There's nothing nicer than to hook a uh, fast bowler for four, especially if you manage to get the shot right. But I think that you should try to play the hook and pull shot because if you perfect it, there are plenty of runs to be made in that area. In fact, I'd go further. There's no point in eliminating any shot. You've got to try them all, and then, depending on your personal view of how you're going, you've then got to make a stance in respect of how you're going to select your shots. And if you don't uh, feel confident with the hook, well, then don't play it. Give Steve Harmison an over. Just the single off the over, then. It's a decent over. I mean, the amount of spin we're getting is, is ridiculous. 
brilliant timing. I can just imagine what's going through the bowler's head right now, and he won't be a happy man. That's high in the air. But it's gone for four. four runs written all over it from the moment well, of I think back. definitely worth doing that again, Swanee. If he's going to whack it, we've got plenty of men out there. Ooh. Chaotic running. There must be a run out here. Wow. Good shot. They should get at least two here. Bats when are coming back for two. Oh, I thought they were trying three there. It would have been a, a little bit risky. Come on, let's get Shane Watson out. Good, good defensive play. 126 for six. Well, the bowlers are taking a bit of stick out there. Let's get Flint off back in. Swanee still doing a great job. Shane Watson has responded brilliantly. sent him back okay so we've got three more balls of chain Watson it's gonna be just the one the batsmen are coming back for a second Batsmen change their minds. Come on. Dropped. Oh, well, it wasn't dropped. Let's take a look at that from another it angle. It was an inside edge, but a hit off himself. And the end of the over. A little bit fortunate there. But that's the way things go. Starting to get back into that zone where we're troubling him. Oh, that Time could be out. Field. It's in his back leg. Not out. Oh, that, that was really close. was a hopeful shout. Let's have another look at this one. Let's take another look at that in replay. That mustn't have been far from being inside the line. It was Let's very take a look close. At very close. <laughs> Good shot. Again, at least two here. Bats when are coming back for two. He sent him back. What a mix up. There's bound to be trouble here. <laughs> Big appeal. Oh, the umpire yeah. turns that one Outside down. But the it line. must have been close. But this Ridiculous how close we're getting now. End of the over, 137 for six. A very good over, only two off it in the end. Okay. 3 8 for six now. Nicely 
And this is where you hope they come back Perhaps for two. Coming back for a second. No thoughts about a three. Swept away. There's a man out there. Come back for two. Mm, that was close. Good running though. Being in the air, very unorthodox shot, but chaotic running. There must be a run out here. But they're getting away with it. That's the main thing. There's been a move away from using specialist wiki keepers more emphasis placed on selecting batsmen who can one run off the over see how we get on this time <laughs> good ball We're scoring at a prolific rate at the moment Was in the air, but not taken. Oh, this is good ball in from Graham Swan. Batsmen are looking for two. Come on, go for the third. That's it. That's it. Yes. Well, Shane Watson gone. Again. And now Mitchell Johnson comes to the crease. Beautifully played. That's raced away through. This will be very disappointing. Oh, the up between the oh, again. This really is impressive scoring now. Good ball and 298 to avoid the follow on for Australia. This has been a good ball and performance. No ball. Uh, no ball. We'll just keep peppering the stumps here. Something's got to give. Nothing edge there. End of the over. One fifty-two for seven. No run there. Just the one off and the now over. Now we're going to get uh, Graham Swan versus Mitchell Johnson. <laughs> and he catches him. He's caught and bowled. And there's the five wicket hole. And now Brett Lee comes to the crease. And we finish this off. Very well played. That was a fine shot for four. Mm. 
We want this isn't a bad start from Brett Lee, who again he can bat. Is it going to catch? That's it is. Cool. Well, with Orange, you never know. But Brett Lee's gone. Sixth wicket for Graham Going Swan. Title, and yeah. now Peter Siddle comes to the crease. End of the over. 156 for nine. The bowler concedes four from the over. Up of the stumps of Simon Catch again. As we dip over the hour mark for the episode. It's a good shot, but it's going to mean Peter Siddle is on strike. Against Andrew Flint off, and surely that's not what Australia want right now. God, Catatrice on 99. Unbelievable, isn't it? He has been superb. <laughs> good over. 157 for 9. A very good over. Only one off it in the end. And now Graham Swan. Again to Simon Catch. And we get this final wicket. certainly tested the keeper out with that one. Son's just not going to get the same impact on Simon Catech, you feel. He would, of course, and born to Peter Siddle. But there's his sentry, Simon Katic. Oh no, he hasn't run. Oh no. Well, why didn't he run? And now, only one off the over. We've got Flint off versus Siddle again. And surely this is going to be all she wrote. Just about surviving at the moment. He's got the edge. Oh, 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 oh. Inside edge there. <laughs> Suppose we could. Oh dear. That was a wide. <laughs> Terrific shot. Oh, he whacks that away. Four runs. Good stuff. Oh, what can I say? He looks in top form today. That was a very confident shot. Surely that's going to be his century. There it is. And he's got Peter Siddle on strike. So Simon Kanich 
A brilliant innings from him, and it is a century. He's very pleased. Super innings, he's batted really well out there. And yeah, you know it's bad when you carry the bat and you've scored. Next one are coming back for two. A large percentage of your team's runs. is good from Patich uh, from Siddle sorry it's just defending <laughs> which is stuff the other guys couldn't do Sixty-six no for nine. Delivery. Three off the over. I'm going to give Anderson an over. Here we go. Bats when are looking for two. Three off that over. Let's give Stuart Broad a go. Look how much swing he got on that. Crazy. Edge oh. to slip. Not a bad little over from Stu Broad so far. Is 172 for nine. Made an over. Anderson back in. Let's see what he can do. Uh, actually, hit the stumps there with Anderson. Oops. Not really sure what's what happened there. I'm not sure we're going to manage to do this in today's episode, which is a shame. That's when I'm coming back for a second. That's oh, is it going to be? Oh, that was That's close. That appeal. was close. There's the signal. He's safe. Yeah. Got ball. That's two from the over then. I have no idea what happened in that over. Right, we're going to get... Graham Swan bowling again. Physical fitness is a major part of modern cricketers' training regime. What impact do you think this has had? Oh, appeal. that could be a lot closer. And from another angle? Let's see. This could be a lot closer. Mm. 
They're tough ones for the umpire. We get to see it in slow motion. That's out. With it's out. Over and over. But in the middle, and that's it. One shot at it at full speed. That's gone. Well, you just cannot believe that Australia have thrown so many wickets away with really poor running between the wickets. The well, there he's, he's gone, out. and Australia all out for 177, like 179, he's getting a polite and we will be enforcing the, the follow-on. So you can see, 648 in our first innings, Australia 179 in their first innings, and now we come out to the middle, really and we will be continuing here in the next episode next Saturday. So if you have enjoyed it, Give it a big thumbs up down below. Subscribe for more cricket content in the future. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.